Kind of rough to see him here at the pitch for the goal line, but we'll go for it. Oh, Bo! Bo score, bro! What a play! That was amazing. What is going on, guys? You're back with another video in the Browns Fantasy Draft franchise. We are, of course, 2-1. and one. We took a three-point loss to the Jets. It was a great game, though, I will say. Uh, let's take a look. We are number one in our yard still, and I think that's because I keep forgetting to sim with 15-minute quarters. So uh, we will start doing that very soon, I promise, uh, now that we have a huge lead over the, the competitors, but that's still something we need to do. We have four great linemen that are really young. Uh, center could be uh, upgraded. Receiving-wise, we have Ross at number five. I've been debating on putting him at running back because I think we, I mean, we did a video, and I think he went to, what, was it an 88? It was something really high overall as a running back. So I'm debating it. We'll see. Uh, but we will have John Ross as our number two return man and probably our number one kick returner, our punt returner anyways, because McCaffrey is the starting running back after all. Whoa, why is it so big? Whoa. So we have a lot of youth at wide receiver, but that doesn't always translate to talent. So we will still take a look at some of the wide receiver prospects. 24 years old is a little old for me. Damn, that guy was looking decent. Deep threat. Really not a whole lot of super talents yet, but there is a lot of first-round wide receivers, which is a good sign. I mean, there's lots to choose from. Haven't done any, seen any news for our uh, relocation yet. Hopefully that comes up soon. The Oakland Raiders are a pretty decent overall, and we see they're the same record as us. Let's see what we can do. So is that their best cornerback, Shaquille Griffin? We should be able to dot them up pretty nicely this game. We'll see though. Sliders are uh, rough. We've been uh, we've been doing okay. Last week's loss was kind of unfortunate, but we have a good chance. I think I feel good about the ability to win this game, and uh, we could see two rather old teams going at it here. We are the away team, so we will get to receive as we prefer. And uh, the Vikings won. That doesn't matter for this league at all. Come on. Uh-oh. Ooh, there you go. Good hit. Who is their quarterback? That's the, the big need to know. And it is... Is that Bortles? I believe that's Blake Bortles. It is Blake Bortles. And holy crap, he's off to a pretty good start. Seven touchdowns, zero picks, 803 yards. Not a bad season for Bortles so far. Let's see if we can, uh, we can rattle that season on him a little bit. Starting off... On defense, as we like to, Tevin Coleman appears to be their running back. Lots of big bodies here. This could be a run. Let's move. Let's shift everyone. No, 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 no. That's no. no. That's all right. That's all right. Good job, Tremaine. Let's take a look at their full roster, though. We see a uh, good left tackle, really good left tackle, decent center, great right tackle. So their uh, their tackles are insane. Jordy Nelson, Antonio Brown, they have, uh, they have a decent offense. I can see why uh, Bortles is definitely succeeding. Kyle Rudolph's still a good target. Yeah, they got a pretty damn good offense. I mean, if you're going to have two good linemen, you want it to be those tackles. Well, it's not really helping them on the inside so far as they've gone two for nothing so far on the ground pretty much. They want the DT to drop back into coverage. I don't want it. We will leave the middle wide open if we have to. And that is really good coverage by uh, Lattimore. I really wish he would have picked that, though. Jordy was sitting on the route. He could have picked sixed it. Good stop, though. I mean, that's a, a three now. I like it. For some reason, you guys want to see my sliders, which they're really, I'm telling you, they're nothing special so far. I, honestly, the way the sliders work this year, it honestly feels like they're almost useless. The, uh, the AI is already very good on all Madden. And John Ross... We'll take it back almost to where he's supposed to be. So an average return. Can't really blame him for taking it out. Take a look at our huddle. Let's see what our quarterback is up to. Five touchdowns, five picks, more yards. Look at Josh uh, Allen. He looks, he does not look ready. <laughs> Get off to a hot start this game. And there it is right there. Not taking a hit with Callaway. Not taking a hit with anyone. I don't want to get, I don't want anyone to get hit. McCaffrey, does he really have the lane? We'll still take it. We'll take it. Oh, no. Shouldn't have taken it. Car game just does not work against the AI. Ian McCaffrey. I mean, I had to go very far out there to avoid that DT and barely gained anything. So third and eight potential back-to-back -back three and outs. And we're taking a look at their defense. Khalil Mack makes up for an insane left end. 
Uh, which is weird because they're playing opposite sides. Shane Ray, that's interesting. So are they playing a 3-4 hybrid? Or are they playing a 4-3? I don't really know. DBs are not very good, so I probably should be striking the air a little bit more here. Let's see what they can do. Third down. This is a huge down for both teams. And I throw a right to Cole. I don't know why I thought I could get it over him when I literally clearly could not. Should have double tapped it, but if I double tapped it, he would have got me as well. I really don't know how to... How to throw that ball there. That's a bad decision, though. Give me this. Shazier gets a pick right back, and Shazier might be able to finish it. Tevin isn't good enough. Oh, down to the 40. That was a really good return. Well, I mean, we're going to call that a tactical interception. Now the drive goal is to not throw a pick. Obviously, that was the goal for every drive, but this drive specifically underneath. Shark. Damn, that's a really good hit. Shark wide open again, actually. Look at that acceleration. Cole feeling pumped, and he's got a pick. Got a really big hit there. I mean, he's playing pretty well. Maybe not. Rolling out to the right, and that is not a good throw. I thought Scriny was going to pick it off. Or Scrine, whatever his damn name is. I never knew his name. Ever since he was young. Quick throw inside. Shark, about nine-yard gain. Shark has been the guy for short yardage this game. Third and one, you'd figure, hey, maybe on third and one, you'd be able to get a run in. Let's find out. Nope. No first down. I will say, I actually kind of like this a little bit more. This should work. There you go. McCaffrey fighting. Gets about seven. Inside, Evan Ingram wide open. No one even close to him. And there's a touchdown. So, got our goal, and we equalized the picks again. Hold them to a back-to-back -back three and outs. Although we have OB on Jordy. I don't know how to feel about that. And I don't know who that was, but he got burned. Come with some pressure again. Getting a little wild on the uh, the coverage a little bit. It's a good time to blitz, I think. Oh. oh, really good time. Who is that? Josh Jones, who might have the most sacks on this team, to be honest. One of the DBs does. I don't know if it's Josh, but somebody's been on the edge. When we run, run the corner or the safety blitzes, they begin to pressure, and honestly, everyone else, not not so much. It's unfortunate because I really want Evan Ingram to have a very good season for us because I really like him. I like him a lot, but he just hasn't been really the guy for us. Cooks, nice catch. Under pressure, almost debatably could have been picked. That's like their one good DB as well. Chark. Oh, look at the pressure. Please don't fumble. Thank you. Don't really trust McCaffrey here. Unless I can move McCaffrey to the other side. And streaking. That could be something. Callaway, and that's a I mean that's a good time ball, but I don't know if Callaway just came out of it late. What's the story? Something off something off about that. Somebody made a mistake. Still have the lead. Wide open over the middle, and the pressure gets there in time, so Bortles being forced to a pretty rough game so far. Gonna play a part of the five man here. Could be a run in general. It is. And there he goes. Landry strips the ball. How did he do that? Somebody recovers. Jonathan Allen with the recovery. Damn, he just, like, punched him. Chark has a shot with the ball. Nice little spin inside to get the first down. Ingram. Oh, Ingram, you got to stop running there, man. You had the boundary, and you just kept going. To the outside, that might be a pitch. Get in there. Nice D by them, in all fairness. It technically was a throw. Kind of rough to see him here at the pitch for the goal line, but we'll go for it. Oh, Bo! Bo score, bro! What a play! That was amazing. Delay. Good job, Tremaine. Tremaine's been doing pretty well. Is this going to be another stop? I haven't changed any of the sliders to make them play worse either. We're just doing really well. There they go. Actually, no, I think they have had a couple of first downs, to be fair. Free lane to run it. Creeping out with Melly. Melly Fonwu, damn it. Somebody got to get that nice play. Melly Fonwu looking like a linebacker out there. It's a pretty damn good throw by Bortles. Under pressure, just dimes it. Got him with Shazier. I mean, there's really not been a whole lot for them to go with in the ground game. Over the middle. That's my fault. And Jordy makes a move on me. 
It's a first down. I mean, I had to kind of play it deep. Otherwise, he throws that instantly. I think what the problem was, though, I needed to get back sooner. Oh, I got hammered. Get up. Good job, 37. Jesus. The penalty did very well there. I'm glad we accepted it. However, if they would have run the same play, it would have been a fourth and one. So, who knows? If they convert this, might be regretting it. Inside. Tony Brown tries his best. It's going to be a fourth down and about four. Just go with a simple screen pass. Who is it going to be? McCaffrey. Come on. Oh, man. If somebody could have just body, Like, you don't have to block. Just, just get in his way, you know. Just stand there. Can't get off the line. Worth a lick. All right. I don't know how the hell that wasn't at least deflected by Tremaine. And once again, this game is flawed. So they're going to get one last throw off. And that's how it ends with a sack by uh, Chris Jones. So flawed game. I'm not going to call a timeout for them, though. But oh, well, I mean, we end the half up 11 with ball. Just streak Evan Ingram. See what he can do. Get open. And I lost connection to the EA servers. Servers can't hold me down. Well, they, I mean, they did hold me down, but we're back. Can't hold me down forever. Put a little bit of air on that. Come on. Okay, let's just not block. At least we got the first down. Evan Ingram. Nice little, uh, nice conversion. Usually we don't beat anyone for streaks these days, but let's try it. Let's try it. I said let's try it. And Cooks does it. Down to the 16. Cooks has made some very nice catches this game. I am a very proud father of my receiving core. We've tried this play before. Let's see if it works. Probably not. And that's my fault. I brought Edmonds in. I thought maybe I can get a free lane and get him, but I could not. There's an injury time. I don't know if that's an update, but i like to see that. Not like the actual injury, but the, I don't know if that is that like an update. Maybe there was an update, and that's why it took me to pause. I don't really know, but that's a cool, cool little feature. Unless it just happened randomly. Come on. I can't get off the line worth a lick. I mean, that's great coverage so far. And Lattimore, what are you doing? Okay, he swats it out at least. Lattimore just does not want interceptions. We're going to have to rush up the middle with Edmonds as well. And there's a pick for a Hooker who just does not want it. These DBs don't want these interceptions, I guess. But it will more than likely force a punt. I mean, we don't know. It could be a fake. Evan Ingram, can we get Shark inside? I mean, I would trust the run here. Screw, we're going to run the ball. Third and six, catch him off guard. I'm going to need number 65 to make a play. Thank you. And then McCaffrey does the rest. Good job. I told you, 65. It was all you, man. McCaffrey underneath. Doesn't catch a block if uh, Brandon Cooks wanted a block there. McCaffrey would have been fighting one-on-one. -on -one. Their linebacker is facing the wrong way. What a block. McCaffrey gets about seven. You have Jabal Sheard over on that side, though. He's going to be a very smart player. He might blitz here. I'm actually going to run a slant. Come on, blitz those linebackers for me. Come on. Kind of. In between, and Evan Ingram drops it. Of course we can't catch one in traffic. And, okay. EA literally said no to that one. Josh Allen misses it by a mile. He missed a four-yard throw by, like, ten yards. That's impossible. To blitz. Huge hit by Landry. He's already forced one. Had a chance at number two there. Underneath, wide open. I mean, everyone underneath is wide open. Try to hit him. Could not do it. I don't know how the hell we're doing so well, but we are. Coming from a team that can't pass rush worth a lick. I'm going to go for the pick here. And it's picked off by Hooker. I don't know why he keeps falling down backwards, but to the two-yard line. It was a risky decision to pick it, but we got it. See what we can do at bench. Gasecki, come on. Been pretty much useless for us. Go, Josh Allen. What a play. Don't know how the hell he broke off that sack. Tried to step up and throw, but I got grabbed. Chark. No one on him. That's an easy first down. Should have threw to Y. McCaffrey. What a move, but he gets popped by Shane Ray. Run up the middle with Josh Allen again. Getting out of trouble with the legs. Kaseki. 
wide open. I mean, we are living by the third down here. This might be a little deep of a route, but Evan Ingram could get open wide. Could be picked. Cooks, Colds on. Gets to the two. What a catch. We'll still go for it. One to beat. Couldn't get the cut. Cole has been great this game, or whoever it is. Number 51 has been great for them. Give me this. Somebody jump. Where's the effort? Barely caught him with Jazier there. I thought they were actually going to give him the pick there. I thought I earned the pick. I thought they were going to give him the catch there. I thought we should have the pick if we're being honest. Already had one bait with Shazier this game. Can we get a second? Yes, we can. Give it to me. Shazier to the 21. There we go. Shazier, possible player of the week. Nice stuff. Third on the season as well. Not bad. A victory is a victory. We win 20 to 3. Defense was outstanding. Lights out. Made all the plays they needed to. Got a couple of turnover forces as well. A very good performance. Uh, pr primarily of the D-line. I know we really didn't get the pressure we were looking for, but we stopped the ground attack, which almost automatically set up the lockdown coverage. I mean, we held them to 19 rushing yards, 132 passing yards, but most of that was on one drive in the second quarter. Took the ball away four times on them. I would have liked to see us do a little better on offense, but we did everything we needed to to get the victory, which will put us to, I believe, what, 4-1 and one now? Either 3-1 and one or 4-1. and one. It's hard to tell. The season's flying by. One pick for Josh Allen, but obviously we finished pretty well. Three picks for Bortles, who was, uh, you know, pickless on the season before then. McCaffrey kind of jumped his numbers up a little bit later in the game, but still nothing to really be excited about. Lots of possessions or uh, completions, just not a whole lot of yards. Defensively, let's take a look. Any sack totals? We had one for Chris Jones, Tremaine, Josh Jones. They had four sacks. Pernell McPhee, damn, they actually have... I know they're a little bit older, but you see the depth they have. That's insane. Picks, two for Shazier, one for Hooker, and one pick for Dylan Cole. But yeah, that was uh, the game. Week four, I believe. So that would be uh, probably a three and one, I assume. Evan Engram, ironically, gets a skill point, and he wants vertical. I love it because that's my favorite one to upgrade. And let's see what do we get. Catching, deep route, break tackle, catching traffic, mid route. Not bad, I suppose. Quick dev. Uh, catching's actually not too bad. It's super, super fast, though. God damn, he's a speedy guy. We just get his uh, route running up a little bit. He will be a deadly fella. Happy with that victory. Moving on to 3-1. See, we have to play the Ravens. What is their record? One and three. Ooh, start relocation. Relocation team. What do we do? I think uh, whatever the Desperados is, let me know what you guys think. See a lot of different teams. I think uh, it's the Austin. Yeah, Austin Desperados. It's a four interest, decent market size, front runner personality. That's. I mean, that sounds pretty good to me. Obviously, teams London and Mexico. New places, Orlando, Florida, apparently not. But yeah, I think uh, Austin might be the place to go. But let me know what you guys think. We will deal with that at another time. 3-1, and one, what are the players of the week? Bengals are right on our tail, by the way. Players of the week, uh, surprisingly not us. I, I think two picks is better than one pick for six because that could just be a lucky pick six. But two picks, that tells you, hey, I had a game. Reward me. But, yeah, I mean, that's the video. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed week four in the books. Going against the one and three Ravens, obviously, very early in the season. So, they could get a win here. That would be very huge for them, especially the Bengals. And it would put us at a three and two, which is kind of a rough spot to be in. Four and one, I love. But three and two could be a little rough. Hopefully you guys come back for next video. But until next video, see ya.